Just uh, overall, how is the transition into the defensive scheme going? Obviously, working mostly at inside linebacker right now with, with Coach Will Hoyt, but just how's the transition going for you? Yeah, it's always, you know, every day is different, right? Some days are better than others. Um, I think now things are settling after the first couple weeks and get to reevaluate film. And, you know, I've been putting in a lot of work with the coaches and the players and uh, just trying to get a good base of uh, what they do, uh, excuse me, what we do, um, and how they want it done. And I'm just trying to do the best I can to master that as quickly as possible so we can put a product on the field that the fans want and um, that are up to my standards as well. How does this compare to uh, past training camps for you, just the way things are being run and just kind of the vibe, the mood? You know, every training camp's different. Everybody's at different stages. Um, you know, I, I think this one has been mentally a lot more uh, than past. Um, and that's okay, that's, that's good. And I think we're, we're doing a good job and we have a good plan and we're just gonna continue to work hard. I think this week's a big week, um, not only for myself, but for the organization to have a, uh, the caliber of the Cowboys come in and practice. And um, they're a good football team, uh, really good players on the other side and it's gonna be a good competition, hopefully you know, we respect each other's crafts and we work hard together, knowing that we're all trying to get better. Kyle, you say mentally, do you mean for you personally? Just yeah, 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 yeah. Just, yeah, sorry, just, you want me to clarify that? Yeah, so just, sure you don't it. put that everybody's having <laughs> mental breakdowns <laughs> over here. <laughs> I assume you meant just because you're adjusting to the defense. Yeah, yeah, of yeah, course, yeah, thanks. Yeah. I should have specified, <laughs> thank you. Yes, me personally, uh, I'm, I'm the one that is, uh, Mentally, it's been a, it's been, it's been a lot, but it's been good. It's like, it's just work, you know. At the end of the day, it's just taking the time, the effort. You know, days are long; they're six to eight for me, and just getting all that extra time. And sometimes they go till midnight, and uh, that's what it takes to win. That's why I'm here because I want to help win, um, and just be the best individual I can be. And I know that's just through hard work. Are you feeling more comfortable? Do I look more comfortable? Yes. Okay. Very there you much. go. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm doing, I'm getting more comfortable and comfortable every day. Uh, I think the players I've leaned on a lot. They've helped me out a lot. Uh, and just putting in extra time, I feel like it may not show up right now, but down the road, uh, it'll show up and I'm going to continue to do that. Who, who's been sort of a sounding board for you? I mean, everybody. <laughs> I can't pinpoint one person. Too many to name. Yeah, exactly. Uh, Kyle, this roster, like from top to bottom, is built potentially, obviously, going to the playoffs, if not further, as a guy who has experience with a very long season and a championship. What needs to happen for a team to make it that far? Uh, I think a lot of things. But uh, honestly, as you say that question, my first answer and I know it might be cliche and dumb but it's so true is just getting to the first game getting everybody on the same page because it's really a one game season we're so focused on the Raiders and playing and preparing for them because they're preparing for us and you know this time right now is to really think about ourselves you know we're not worried about outside noise and what people think of the roster and what uh, the expectations are because we have high expectations for ourselves and we're going to control what we can control as a team, as a unit, you know, individually, as players, as a defensive unit, as a special teams unit, as an offensive unit and blend that all together. And this is a perfect time for competition. It's a perfect time to get to know each other and not focus on outside sources. It's really to, to build the team camaraderie and get close together and then when that time comes, when that first game comes, we're we're ready because we're focused on what we got to do in our task and not anybody else. Is that wisdom that you share with teammates, or does anybody inquire with you, like what what's it like to go to the Super Bowl or anything like that? Yeah, I mean that that talk is that happens every once in a while. But honestly, I tell them, you know, the teams that have gone don't ever talk about it. If you ever notice. Uh, 
my previous employment is never talked about and you know it's something that I don't take lightly and for granted and it's just something you got to work for and if you're make it to that you know that end goal then awesome but it's so far away you just got to focus on the task at hand and that task is to get through training camp get healthy and then get ready for game one because that's what it's all about you spent so many years in one defensive scheme in yeah in new england and then obviously miami too yeah. coming here how different oh is i want to this... prove people i can play uh big chip on my shoulder because i'm kind of tired of hearing the um the noise a little bit saying i can't play in a different system and yada 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 so i'm i'm excited for that challenge i'm excited to uh, prove to my family who cheers for me day in and day out and know the type of player I am to perform and put um, my last name on the field and represent them in the best way possible. But also I want to win. Um, anybody that knows me, I hate, I mean, everybody says this, they hate losing, da da da, and I, I can't stand it. So I just want to win. I really do. Like, I hope you guys see that and everything I do. I hope that energy just flows off everybody that everybody knows when I step on the field I want to win. How much you more than you love winning? <laughs> I don't like that question. <laughs> so, yeah. How much Yeah, something like that. How much is that part of it driving, you know, these late nights in the study just the oh, desire yeah. to prove to people like hey, I can play outside of the scheme in a, in a different scheme. A lot. You know, and I still have a lot of juice left in in the tank. I'm, I'm excited to play. I'm excited to play with the teammates that I have. We've gotten really close already. It's fun uh, to come to work and be around a group that is very hungry, willing to learn, willing to get better by a coach who sets the bar high of being the most hungry out of all of us, I'd say. And it, we kind of feed off that. And we, we just want to prove to him right as well. Um, you know, I've gotten to know him pretty quickly. We've had a great relationship, a great working relationship, and I respect him a lot. And I want him, uh, I want him to, I want to help him get to his dreams and goals as well. How has your relationship grown with uh, Coach Will Hoyt in your time yeah. working with the inside linebackers and the extra worker getting Yeah, in that's a good question. Obviously, you know, ups and downs, right? <laughs> um, but positive. Uh, positive learning, positive communication, and that's all that I I really take to heart is communication, and it's been so fluid, and I, I really appreciate it. It's, it's a stressful business. I know some people can't really understand that sometimes, but it's stressful, and everybody wants to provide for their families and do everything they can uh, in that regards, and, you know, he's been a really, really awesome to re rely on awesome to communicate and just learn the defense from and he's put a lot of time and effort in me and I know that and I I want to prove it to him you know thank you so much for all the effort you've put into me to be able to pr prove that on the field Yeah, that's a good question. I think it's more of like, you know, I, I love competition. It's it's one of the best parts of football, if not the best, um, besides winning. I think it's just focusing on being the best uh, you can be individual, not just on in the football field, but outside of life too. If you have that uh, way about yourself to carry yourself at a high level and, um, do things first class, do things the right way. You know, I give a lot of credit to my dad who installed hard work and, you know, I've taken that into my everyday life and I hope to pass that on to my son and daughter um, just to work hard and compete with yourself because at the end of the day, you know, it's between you and you and, um, yeah, you're just trying to be the best individual you can be. Thanks, Kyle. With starters and last question, sorry. With starters and veterans, you know, hardly playing in the preseason, what is the value of the joint practices? Like, how, how do you approach that, you know, mentally, and like, what are you trying to get out of these next two days? Well, it's good. You see a different scheme. You get to see uh, really quality a quality team like the Cowboys that come in and have had a system under Kellen Moore. 
uh, for a while. Dak knows that offense. The O-line knows the offense. Uh, C.D. Lamb knows the offense. Um, Pollard, you know, really, really, really good players on that office and offensive side of the ball that run at a really, really good clip. And we just got to do everything we can to learn from our mistakes. And when you're able to get a bunch of good quality reps during this time, it's very valuable. Uh, and you kind of try to treat it just as much as a game like as you can because they, they are too. They, want, they don't want to get shown up. We don't want to get shown up and just respect the grind and uh, try to learn those little things that you may have haven't seen it going against your own offense, seeing a different offense and trying to put your tools and uh, different thinking cap on for that is really good.